Oh boy. Atlas contains intense violence, gore, graphic sexual content, and strong language. Please enjoy! <laughs> wow, what a good start to that. You are Miles Upshur, an investigative reporter whose ambition is about to earn him an intimate tour of hell on earth. Always willing to risk digging into the stories no other journalist would dare investigate. You will seek out the dark secret at the heart of Mount Massive Asylum. Stay alive as long as you can. Record everything. You are not a fighter. To navigate the horrors of Mount Massive and expose the truth, your only choices are to run, hide, or die. I don't like the third option. I choose D, none of the above. Oh, we'll wait for Sadistic. He's good. Alright. Here we go. Oh my god, my headset's driving me insane. Insane, I tell you. Massive. What a name. Oh, hi, flying. How are you gonna do that to yourself? I've seen one specific part because Cry was playing it earlier too, and I had to. I had to see. Let me in. September 17th, 2003. From some dumb stuff. Tip, illegal activity at Murkoff, psychiatric systems. You don't know me. Have to make this quick. They might be monitoring. I did two weeks of software consult at Murkoff psychiatric systems facilities in Mount Massive. All sorts of NDAs. I am very much breaking right now, but seriously, fuck those guys. Terrible things happening there. Don't understand it. Don't believe half the things I saw. Doctors talking about dream therapy going too deep, finding something that had been waiting for them in the mountain. People are being hurt and Murkoff is making money. It needs to be exposed. Oh no. Yeah, little Nick, it uh it'll come on mobile ear soon ish. Yeah, it takes a little bit of time. Yeah, it wasn't on mobile for me as well. Got my batteries. Got my camcorder. Gustav. Sweet HUD. Hey, what's up, Otaku? Alright, objectives updated in your reporter's notebook, containing your notes and picked up documents. Cool, cool. Womp womp. Notes. Cool. Documents. The whistleblower. That's that there. Okie dokie. Doki doki! <laughs> Let me in. Now why does why does an outpost in the middle of nowhere get a dual monitor set up and I don't even have a freaking dual monitor set up? This is ridiculous. I can see my feet. Anyways. Hello trash can. Can I play with you? No. Recon does need to wake up.
Yeah, I'll get there. I'll get there, guys. Don't worry. How's the um? How's the camera lighting for everyone? I know it is pretty dark, and not having a dual monitor, uh, will probably make it a little darker. Ha! There you go, Taz. Raise my camcorder. Cool deal. Event recorded. Adding a note in your notebook. Fair enough. I start feeling sick just looking at this place. Well, you and us both. Fair enough. Okay. Cool deal. Uh, shut down amid scandal and government secrecy in 1971. Reopened by Murkoff Psychiatric Systems in 2009 under the guise of a charitable organization. Cell phone reception cut off abruptly a mile out. More like a jammer than lost signal. The Murkoff Corporation has a long track record of disguising profit as charity, but never on American soil. Whatever they thought they could get out of this place has to be big. Might finally be the story that breaks the bastards. Victory sip. Yeah, I wanted to watch Cry as well. I'm so sad I couldn't. <laughs> right, high flying. Okay. So I'm guessing... Notes are only added to your notebook when the camcorder is raised to record events. Fair enough. But that saves battery then, I guess. To not have it up. So I'm cool with that. Yeah, I had, to, I had to avoid watching a lot of people, because uh, once I realized I was going to be playing this game. Can I zoom? Oh my. Oh, hold down. There we go. Okay. <laughs> Avoiding the police. The scared levels. Hello. Little pig, little pig, let me in. Oh, oh, shit, there we go. Not by the hair on my chinny chin chin. Fine. Any other fun happenings going on? Just so you know, guys, I'm an explorer. I like to explore. Nothing too crazy going on. Fair enough. Spam and recon stream. <laughs> oh, you're getting the cousin too? Nice. Oh, yeah, I'm waiting for something to pop out of the window or something like that. What's in here? What are these things? Hmm. Fair enough. Anyways, we're going in. What's up, Inferno Blue? Welcome to the channel, man. Thanks for hanging out. We are just starting Outlast for our little Fright Night uh, stream. Oh, I can jump. Cool. Camcorder active, you can zoom. Oh, there we go. That's what I wanted. I'm in your pond, bitch! <laughs> Nothing like some puddle jumping. <laughs> Everybody's got their underwear. We are prepared. <laughs> Alright. This 
Why is the music doing that? Fair enough. I don't like why the, mu the music is doing that. I hope my volume isn't too loud, because the, the recording was really lo uh, really low, or the radio was really low. So the first thing to make a loud noise is going to blow my freaking head out of my ass. I'm not playing on the toilet? Oh god. Deb is your cousin? Hi Deb! Welcome to the channel, thanks for coming out. And, uh, you can thank your cousin for making this possible. Guess I was just saying B drops down, fair enough. <laughs> Everyone has the, uh, the volumes cranked. Nice. I can see all your stuff. Oh, nice. I'm coming in! Oh, shit. And night vision uses battery life. Manage it well. Oh, okay. Not cool. Oh, so that uses battery life. Okay. I'm in the chimney. Anyways. Can I not pick stuff up? Guess it'll tell me if I can pick it up or not. Fair enough. Paintings and whatnot. Oh, that's how you can like open the door slowly. Fair enough. <clears throat> yeah, music is definitely the worst part. Thank you when I'm getting taken to the hospital. Oh my god. Yeah, I, I did lower my settings for, for... Oh wait, I can like lean and stuff, that's cool. Hooah. Why do you shut doors so hard? So this isn't using my battery life. Okay, cool. Well, then I'll just leave this up the whole time. Why not? Hello? Is anybody home? Nerd. fuck was that? I can shut them softly? Oh, okay. My character hates doors. Hua, <laughs> hua. I feel like I'm playing Daisy. I'm gonna QE people. I'm a friendly! I'm a friendly! So I can. Hold on. Can I close it? How do I close it gently? Recon! Hey, Recon! You didn't, uh, you didn't miss too much. I'm meandering through. Shut it slow! I'm not a bandit! <laughs> We're cool, man. To squeeze through, move towards the gap. Okay. What do we have in here? Show me your secrets! Ooh, a battery. Batteries are used for the infrared light of your camcorder. You can reload by pressing Y. Okay, cool. Fancy seats. Oh, hey! 
Hungry... Hungry Ruka. Hi, welcome to the channel. Thanks for stopping in, man. You have joined us for a an incredible night of uh, Outlast. Anyways, uh, let's see. I'm not sure how it's on the controller, but you need to control the swing of the door when shutting. Okay. Interesting. Um, I know, like, to control the swing, like, I can, um, like, if I want, if I open it, I can hold it, and I can, like, control the swing opening, so I can peek through doors, but, uh, closing it is a different story. He just really, really loves to just shut the hell out of doors. Okay. We have blood. We have blood confirmed. <laughs> Blood's leading to this room. The Okay. I'm cool with that. Hey, what's this? What are you? You're glowing blue. You look like I need to mess with you. Can I hide on the table? Ooh. I'm already I'm finding hiding spots early so I so I know it's about to go on. Anyways. Oh the mouse is easier. That's cool. Oh, really hungry? That's great, man. Yeah, I'm glad I, I was really hoping we get a lot of uh uh, new faces in here to see the beginning of this, because I swear every time I've tried to watch, or er, okay, every time I've come in on a stream, they're at the same exact part, and then I and I stop it because I don't want anything spoiled for me. Project Wall Rider patient status report for William Hope. Will I am Hope. Murkoff Psychiatric Systems Project Wall Rider. Mount Massive Company case number one seventy four patient initials W P H Billy. Oh Billy. Consultation dated stuff. Blah 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 blah. Age 19. Dr. Carl Houston. Therapy status. Patient claims to have progress to self directed lucid dream states. Morphogenic engine activity observed at unprecedented scale. Continuing stage 4 hormone scheduled diagnostics. Spirometry revealed no bronchial accumulation. Hematic crit centrifuge again failed to separate. Er erythrocytes. Highly worrisome. MRI revealed arrhythmic REM and REM cycle. Laughter in NREM state. Interview notes. Billy asked about the status of his mother's lawsuit against Murkoff in the asylum. This represents a catastrophic breach in security, despite Billy's claims that he discovered the truth in the blood dreams of Dr. Traeger. Note, the only Traeger on company records, one Richard Traeger, is an executive from MRD. All orderlies and security personnel must be questioned and video security improved to include an analytical biometrics. Murkoff Psychiatric Systems, Project Wallrider, Mount Massive Company. Cool deal. Our vows here. Nice. I sound like a five foot tall nerdy fuck. Well, hot damn, Boom Shaka. Welcome to the channel. Thanks for stopping in. Sorry that my voice doesn't fit myself. Darn. Oh, we have the same headset. That's great. I like this headset a lot. Anyways. Mike, hey, what's up, man? Welcome to the channel. Making sure I don't pick up anything crazy. Look around for items. You didn't miss too much, Arval. Kenzo, no, I'm not scared just yet. Ha! Huh. Recon's on top of it. And I say, fuck this door! <laughs> We've got bloody footprints. We've got jungle fever. Well, I think before I tackle that one, I need to get a Coke. Hmm. Maybe I don't need to get a Coke. Bad door! Bad door! Nah, you're not gonna regret it, Mike. Oh, I can't even go in, can I? Well, fooey on you. What's in here? Let me in. Garbage. Oh, that sucks. I mean, there's something dead up there. Can I open the fridge? Oh, here we go. More batteries, good stuff. A radio, that doesn't work. 
I want a soda. Come on, man. You a dollar seventy-five for that shit? I don't want a soda after all. Yeah, no. The door is denying me. <laughs> Take your time, Marval. Oh, uh, here we go. Yellow. Oh. Check check this out. Um before I started streaming tonight, I'm absolutely terrified of spiders and right before I started streaming the first thing I saw was a uh, was a spider crawling on my wall. So uh, that kind of prepped me for uh yeah. Thank you, hungry. 175 is cheap. Oh my god. There is no cake. What's up, Qwerty? Yeah, the Coke is a lie. The Pepsi was a lie. Oh, fuck. You yeah, have horrible arachnophobia. Everybody cool? Spiders are good protein. Oh my god. Oh my god, it's horrible hungry. Oh my god, it's horrible. That's so expensive. I see someone sitting down there. <laughs> Fuck my life. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh man, that's fucking horrible. Dude, I, this is ridiculous. This place looks like a fucking fun house. They killed us. They got out. The variants. You can't fight them. You have to hide. You can unlock the main doors from security control. You have to get the fuck out of this terrible place. Wow, this is messed up. Okay, I need to get the fuck out of this room. Wait, who's this fucker? What's up, informant? Looks like I ain't going that way. Isn't he like right there? Apparently he's not there. Okay. I'll take it. Alright, I'm cool with that. I 
can squeeze through there. So well, then what's back in here? Can this open? Can't open. Oh, fuck me. I'm gonna hate the next part. Oh god, no spoilers, please. I'm gonna hate a lot. A hand in the toilet. That's fucked up. Did I get a document or something? No. Nope. Oh, here we go. Holy hell. Stream lagging for you again? God damn, guys. <coughs> What's up, Hellrel? Oh, man. I'm gonna need those batteries. Yeah. Um, okay, so I'm inside. Bodies everywhere. Blood, burn marks. Heads lined up like bottles behind a bar. Dead Murkoff scientists hung from the ceiling. Their badges say Murkoff Advanced Research Systems. Murkoff's longtime MO has been to profit off the exploitation of supposed charity. Fuck the third world and bankroll another billion. How did Murkoff think they would make money off a building full of crazy people? There's some kind of tactical cop pinned like a pig on a spit. Tells me to get the fuck out and then dies. Would have been a good thing to hear when I could still leave the way I came. Yeah, I guess so. Oh, seriously, QWERTY? Damn, son. That's messed up, informant. Out of my way. Huh? Oh, are you fucking kidding me? Oh, I knew I saw somebody. And who are you then? I, I see. Merciful God, you have sent me an apostle. Guard your life, son. You have a calling. Little pig. It was Pudge. It was Pudge from Dota 2. Hooked him. Proclaim the gospel. Escape the asylum. Access security controls to unlock the main doors. Fair enough. Thirty one viewers already? Wow. Looks like we'll be hitting that fifty probably pretty soon. How did I survive that? I have a very strong back. I do a lot of uh extracurriculars. It's a pretty decent fall. Pretty decent fall, I'd say. Wait, footprints going this way. But I can't open it, so I'm cool with that. I'm like, I want to look around. This is like one game. I think this is the only game I've never not wanted to explore in. Oh shit. Wait, do I have my camcorder? Oh, good. Fuck, that would have been hell. You know me in bathrooms. Always a good time. Give me that battery. So what's a variant? Just doing parkour. <laughs> yeah, right, Kickster. Bench pressing women. Yep, that's how I do it. What's in here? Oh, it's the outside. Run, 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 run. I'm cool with this. What's here? Nothing. Hello. What are you doing? Besides being dead. 
Alright, nothing back here. Fair enough. Oh, man. Tons of jump scares. Dude, that one... Of all the doors to not throw open, I picked that one. And... Damn near lost my dinner. I can close this door? Fuck this door! Yeah! Anyways. Da da da, what do we got? Any secrets? Reveal your secrets to me, dead man. I saw a plant and I thought it was a guy. I guess the dude will probably talk some shit before he tries to kill me, so. At least I'll hear him coming. Though I don't. I honestly don't like lit rooms because it's like. In a sea of dark rooms, you see a lit one, and you're like, of course the player would want to go there. It's a lit up room. Why not? <laughs> Everyone's still getting lag. God, that's horrible, man. I'm sad I'm not seeing these, uh, I'm not seeing these gifts. <laughs> oh my god, Negus. Yeah. That's really funny. Just like, well, I'm done here. To Reddit. I'll, I'll spend the rest of my night on Reddit. Oh, I'm the one with the bloody footprints. How about that? Windows 8. Project Wall Rider, status report for Chris Walker. Chris Redfield. Bunch of dumb stuff. Therapy status. Morphogenic engine activity plateaued at roughly 2,000 ppm. Unsafe to progress beyond stage 3 hormone scheduled diagnostics. Spirometry revealed light to medium bronchial accumulation. MRI scans consist with patients' reported dreams and review notes. Walker was interviewed in restraints following his self-inflicted mutilations. Restraints have, have had to be altered to accommodate his enormous size. Well, I guess we found Walker. Extensive dermal eruptions as consistent with failed morphogenic engine cellular activity. He claims the skin ripped from his forehead allows for a truer way of seeing seems to have some boyhood experience with Tutara lizards in their parietal eyes. He was expressed anxiety about his flesh, specifically around his lips and nose, and attending orderlies should be advised to watch for further self-mutilation. The mental traumas he sustained while serving in Afghanistan seem to be retarding progression of the ME process. His predominant fixation, amplified by therapy and a manic exaggeration of military security protocol, a continuation of both chemical and physical restraints is highly recommended. <laughs> Thank you, Nigas. I know what they're talking about. I went to school for that shit. Really, Arval? Come on now. Oh, I can peek. Hello. I'm peeking. Oh. Oh. Do I have to go that way? I don't I don't want to go that way. I refuse to go that way. I have to go that way. Oh, God. Hey, buddy. You doing okay? You need some water? You alright? Okay. I'll be seeing ya. Ooh, what are you guys watching? Is it movie night? 
you aren't watching anything. Mind if I join you? Do you get irritated when I stand in front of the TV? Apparently not. Cause you ain't watching shit. Oh, you look nice, I guess. notes we got. Broken men and dead television. Just another rerun. <laughs> a crowd of broken men watching a dead channel. They look like patients. They survived whatever happened here, but nobody's home. Hello. Oh, he doesn't look like he had a good day. Man, this is the only way I can go. Oh, fuck me. Oh, God. Oh, boy. Can I just shut this door? I don't... You know what? No, just screw it. Oh, great. Oh boy, this is gonna trigger the guy, isn't it? This is gonna piss him off. Oh, fuck me. The little pig's still haunting you? Oh my god. He died from too much porn. Oh god. Collected objects for the thing. Okay, cool. I know it's not that easy. I know it's not that easy. I know it's not that easy. It's never that easy. It's never that easy. I don't know where the security control was either. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Are you serious, Arval? Oh my god. Fuck you, dude. I'm done with you. I was gonna be nice to you, too. I was gonna be nice to you. I was gonna give you some water. No, I'm shutting you in now, asshole. This game's gonna be a freaking heart attack, dude. Well, no one's out here, so we're cool. Hey, what's up, Nar? <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, like, no hints, no... nothing. That counts as spoilers. That's... not cool. It's part of the rules. If you need to go over the rules, it's right below the video. Go check it out. Okay, so I went that way. That way's locked, so we're cool. I'm guessing this is probably the security desk. It is. Good. And we got some documents. True that.
anyways. Warrant for seizure. The matter of the seizure of Mount Massive Psychiatric Center, Murkoff Psychiatric Systems, Mount Massive Wilderness Area, Country Road 112. A fit of its having been made before the board of directors by Murkoff Hardline Security, MHS, <coughs> excuse me, has reason to believe catastrophic security failure of psychiatric center with imminent danger of environment contamination. We are satisfied that the affidavits and testimony establish sufficient evidence to require urgent action on the part of MHS and grounds of the issuance of this warrant. You are hereby required to grant MHS full access to all facilities and surrender complete authority with agents by acceptance of this document. You and any surviving relatives surrender all claims of litigation against the Murkoff Corp. Or the subsidiaries for the actions of MHS or the circumstances which required their actions, regardless of responsibility. Look, responsibility! I guess I can't do anything here. <laughs> wow, Nar. That's pretty rough. Oh my god, someone's behind me. I want to push the wheelchair. Oh, really? Wait, how? While running? Oh, that's sick. Wow. I like that. Alright, well, generally I like to not follow blood. doing? You guys look like you're doing alright. Oh. What the shit just pounded? Did someone shut the door? Dude, are you serious? Quit shutting doors on me, dog. Somebody pooping. You in here pooping? Prepare your anus. Witness. Can I get a witness? What? Who? What is up with these guys trying to flush hands down the toilet? Just shut this door. Nope. Okay. Do 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 do. Oh, found security. I want to know what you guys were doing. What were you doing, buddy? Oh, you're not gonna let me in. Fine. Fine. Have it your way. This is Burger King. Wap wap. Sirs. Dear sirs. Oh, who's out of here? Camarado? I hope you're not out of here. Oh, I got a camera. <laughs> right? Everyone's like, oh shit. Jessica Blankets, hi, welcome to the stream. Thanks for stopping in. We just started some Outlast. Good times for everybody. 
Anyways, dear sirs, the full report pending no immediate action is required on the part of the Murkoff Corp. The profit potential of Project Wallrider remains staggeringly high before fatalities containing enough ambiguous data to make any litigation if evidence is correctly managed impossible. Project Wallrider remains a dangerous initiative, and there will almost certainly be further casualties. As with the others, however, family and government interest in the patients is so low as to make any chance of legal actions vanishingly unlikely. Violence among patients is increasing as the morphogenic engine therapy gets closer to producing working models, but a combination of physical and chemical restraint has proven sufficiently effective to assure continued control and profit. Respectfully, Helen Granite, Murkoff Legal Mitigation Department. Oh yeah, Jessica. Yeah, I always see the same exact part, and then I stop it right there, and because I didn't want to spoil it for myself. Moving on then. And the beat keeps running, running, and running, running. Let me in. I want to party. I want to party. Why should we have to pay for it? Why do we have to die? Walker will kill us just for being sick. We're still people. We didn't choose this. Oh, hot damn. It is, uh... Yeah, it's pretty freaking creepy. I'm usually I'm not one to get too spooked by games, but uh this one has caught me off guard a couple times. Little pig, little pig, let me in. Shut the door because you need access to get in here, so I'm should be okay. What do we got? What do we got? Unlock main doors, cool, cool, cool. What do we got over here? Nothing. I can hide in a locker, that's always fun and good. Good to know, good to know. So before I do this, <laughs> you guys are freaking out, <laughs> little pig. Hide in locker, safe forever. Metal Gear Solid taught me a lot of things, and it was hiding in a locker is generally a good thing to do. Hey, there's the stairs that I was gonna go down earlier. Hi there. Oh, he knows. What? Oh, fuck me. Are you serious? If you open this... Oh fuck. Oh fuck, oh fuck. Oh, you only opened the one? Smart ass. You better walk the fuck away, dog. Just walk away. That's what I thought. Get recorded, son. Welcome to the movies. You're a part of the show. <laughs> Alright guys, stream's over. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna hang out here for the rest of the game. Um I'm gonna count I'm gonna chalk that one up as a victory. I beat the game. My guy will hang out in the locker for the rest of forever. Thanks for tuning in. It was fun. <laughs> What'd I get? A note? Here we go. Big, I love this note. Big fucking guy. That's great. <laughs> the big fucker is stalking me. Found a patient file for a Chris Walker, ex-military police, several tours in Afghanistan. A lot of the blood in this place is on his hands, but not all of it. Speedrun. I just finished this game in, like, record time. Because that's the secret. It's like that unfair Mario level where you let the boo kill you. This is here, you just... You just sit. You just stay in the locker and call it. So where do I want to go? 
Hey friend. I wanna get the fuck out of here real quick. Oh shit, are you serious? I have to like, it's all dark? Oh my god. Alright, we're going to the stairs. See ya! Hope you didn't hear that, asshole. I like to slam the hell out of doors. It's my thing. It's my M.O. Give me that shit. How to speed run Outlast? <laughs> Start new game, quit new game. Oh man. Pig man bear. On Wednesday, 10th of February, 1954, hypnotic experimentation and research work was continued in Building 13 of Mount Massive Preserve in Colorado using the following subjects. Material abridged. 1. A post-hypnotic of the night before, pointed finger, you will sleep, was enacted. Mrs. Jackson, all, sorry Mrs. Jackson, and Pierce, immediately progressed to a deep hypnotic state with no further suggestion. Miss Pierce was then instructed, having previously expressed a fear in firearms in any fashion, that she would use every method at her disposal to awaken Miss Jackson, now in a deep hypnotic sleep. And failing this, she would pick up a nearby pistol and fire it at Miss Jackson. She was instructed that her rage would be so great that she would not hesitate to kill Jackson for failing to awaken. Miss Pierce carried out these suggestions to the letter, including firing the unloaded pneumatic pistol gun at Jackson and then proceeding to fall into a deep sleep. After proper suggestions were made, both were awakened and expressed complete amnesia for the entire sequence. Miss Pierce was again handed the gun, which she refused in an awakened state to pick up or accept from the operator. She expressed absolute denial that the foregoing sequence had happened. Hot dog! <laughs> oh my god. You guys are insane. You guys are crazy. I I love this. This is the best game I've ever played, dog. To vault. Can do. Who's there? Oh. Who are you? You're not a friendly. I didn't see you QE in at all. Is this the generator, potentially, maybe, hopefully? Turn on the two gas pumps in the main breaker to restart the generator. Fair enough. Our Val. Just watch it, man. We have, like, a lot of doors. So... Let's just go. Let's just go. Okay, well, this looks to be what I want. Okay. Is that going to make a lot of noise? Yes, is the answer to that question. Give me this battery, because I'm going to need it. Shit. YOLO! Later! Fuck, 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 fuck. Can I hide? Yeah. I don't want to see him. I don't even want to see him. I haven't had to change my underwear just yet. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, right, Camarado? Screw watching the game. It, I look to be okay. You watch. I, I'm going to come out, and he's going to come in. Here's the second gas pump. Now I'm gonna hide. There's no way. Gabby Douglas. <gasps> I knew it. You're not the walker. If 
you look under this bed, I swear to God. No. No. Okay. We're gonna reload this bad boy. He's horny. Really? You're gonna sit exactly where I need you to not be? Come on, dickhead. Yeah, go take a walk. I hope you don't hear very well. Fuck you and turn on the power! Oh, there's- wait, what? Turn on two gas pumps and the main breaker? Oh, you gotta be shitting me right now. Where are you? I see you! Oh god. <sighs> yep, you just keep going that way, buddy. We're gonna- me and you are gonna have a partnership. Shit, wrong door. That's the one. Okay. Oh, fuck me, fuck me, fuck me, fuck me. Bye! Hide, quick! Damn! Oh, you motherfucker, thank you. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> wow. There's a raid right now? What? I'm being raided? Oh, Jesus. He just wants to test the durability. Rizzo raid! What's up, guys? I literally missed the raid. Are you serious? Oh my god, hold on. <laughs> Well, uh, guys, sorry, but, uh, I was too busy running for my fucking life, but, uh, yeah, thank you, thank you very much, Rizzo, um, I cannot believe I just missed that, but at the same time I kind of can because I was too busy shitting myself, but everyone that came in, stopped in, hung out, if you're still here, I need to, like, not die for a second, oh, fuck, are you serious? Yeah, actually, I saw, um, I actually saw Rizzo playing this last night, and once again, had to not spoil it for myself. I, like, totally lost track of where I was going. And, uh, yeah, at that, guys, is it time for the giveaway, then? <laughs> Everyone just... We're all just going to have a group shit. Did he hear that? I wonder if he heard that. Okay. Alright, guys. Um, I'm going to kill the lights. Okay, we're going to do the giveaway because, um, yeah. Uh, you guys all came in? Holy hell. Anyways. Um, yeah, I said 50 viewers are going to do a giveaway. I can't believe I missed that raid. Rizzo, thank you. You sweetheart. Um, I appreciate that. <laughs> I cannot believe I freaking missed that. But, uh, yeah. Hi, everyone. Uh, we're gonna do the giveaway real quick then. I can't freaking believe I missed that. Oh! Rizzo, yeah, that'd be totally fine. Awesome. I am having a hell of a time dealing with, uh... <laughs> I miss every raid. I swear to God, I, ri I miss every single one. Every single one. Um. So, 
let me get this going on for you guys real quick. Rizzo, once again, thank you a lot. Thank you. <laughs> you and Goldie have been blowing my freaking stream up. Uh, so here's Streamception for everyone. Ho ho. Uh, there's our giveaway. And uh, guys, just so you know, I don't have dual monitors. So that's kind of why um, I've been missing some of the stuff. I've been using my phone. Ta da! Um, as my chat. So, yeah. Um, Rizzo, as you can see, is posting the codes right there. Thank you very much, Rizzo. That's probably easily the best way to do that. <laughs> no double take this time. Guys, literally, I was freaking out. I was too busy running for my freaking life. So, yeah. Give me a, give me a little bit of credit. But once again, Rizzo, thank you so much, seriously. I'm actually really sad I wasn't able to watch you play this <laughs> because I've been trying to spoil it for myself. Everyone's always at the same exact part. Tape my phone to the screen. Yeah, who got the codes? Uh, we're going to do that. Let's see here. Alright, guys, make sure. <laughs> it's actually Cherry Pepsi. Kepster got the arcade. Nice, nice. Um, like I said, if you want to be a part of the giveaway, just say something in chat. So, as to not miss any lurkers or whatever. <laughs> something, something. Hit the follow button if you like. It's always good. I'll let uh, chat calm down. Once chat kind of calms down, then we'll do our thing. Make sure there's no one... Okay, yeah, Nightbot is definitely not going to be a part of this. Other than that, I think we're good. Thank you, everyone that stopped in. Thank you, Rizzo, for sending everyone here. And uh, thanks to anyone who follows. Uh, we just started Outlast pretty much, so if you haven't seen the whole thing, definitely stick around. Check it out. It's really good. Something, something dark side. Something, something complete. Okay. Everyone calm down. We cool? 50 people? We good? Good to start? All right, looks like it. Okay, everyone, this is a random game giveaway. Um, after the winner does his thing, uh, I'll let you know the games you can pick from. And with that, good luck. Oh, and there's another code from Rizzo. Make sure you pick that up. Boom. Wizard Milk Shack. You just won. There you are. Nice. Okay. Congrats. Congrats. Congratulations. Anyways. Uh, congrats, wizard. Hacks. No hacks. There were no hacks. You saw everything. Just be happy. Be happy. Anyways, I'm going to turn this back off of here. And uh, so, wizard, the games that you had to pick from are Medal of Honor, Mirror's Edge, and those are Steam keys. I also have Origin keys for Dead Space, Burnout Paradise, Crisis 2, Medal of Honor, Mirror's Edge, and I also have The Binding of Isaac, Gary's Mod, uh, and Chivalry, as well as The Ship. Quite a list of stuff to pick from you have your pick of the litter. The ship? Awesome! Reroll. Can't you guys just be happy? Can't you just be happy for someone for once? Okay, uh, wizard? If you would like to message me your Steam 
and then I'll trade that with you real quick. And thank you everyone who participated in the giveaway today. Oh, that's what it is? Okie dokie. <laughs> what is this happy? I know nothing of your happy. Alright guys, give me one second while I make sure Wizard gets his stuffs. And also, uh, can we thank Arval for donating that game to myself? So, thank you very much Arval for making that donation possible. Or for making that giveaway game possible. Thank you, thank you. Without you, that game would not have even been in there. Alrighty. Wizard, I just sent you an invite. I thought that this would be a good a good break from uh everyone shitting themselves. So I'm cool with that. Hey what's up affectionable? Welcome to the channel. As well as I think I saw Dunn stop in. <laughs> everyone needs to yeah, take the take take the time, change your underwear, you know, do what you gotta do. I'm all out of poop. I've got no more poop. <laughs> I have no poop left. Bam. There is the ship. And there you are, good sir. Thank you very much for stopping in and participating in the giveaway. Hell, well, you're out. All right, man. Thanks for stopping in. <laughs> Little Nick needs a minute, uh, one minute. All right, all right. Anyways, once again, thank everyone who is here right now. Everyone who stopped in, and thanks a lot to Rizzo for sending you all here. Thank you very much, Rizzo. That was very, very awesome of you. I hope your Outlast playthrough went. Well, <laughs> sadly I couldn't see it. <laughs> Alrighty. <laughs> oh my god, Jessica. Okay, and uh, I think we are good to get back in it. Alright, oh my god, I'm not even sure if I'm ready for this shit. That was a much warranted break, and now... Ugh. <laughs> Affection, will you ready? Is everyone ready? Everyone got the change of pants, everyone got their lights on now. I'm like, this is the fucking scariest damn pause screen. Turn off the light behind me? I can turn off the light behind me. Here, I'll turn the light off. Do you guys want absolute, absolute darkness? Now it's like too dark in here. I can't. <laughs> I can't see. 
I couldn't see where my stuff was. All right, game time. Whoop! And da da! Oh shit! Wrong button! Wrong button! Oh fuck! I'm not ready for this! I am not ready for this! Holy shit! Holy shit! Holy shit! I forgot how to run! I forgot how to run! At the worst time to forget how to run! Holy hell! Fuck me, dude! <laughs> okay! I remember how to run! Again. That was like the worst compilation of I forgot my buttons I've ever had in the game, ever. Harry, take care, man. Okay, so I'm gonna stop hiding. I need to find this goddamn thing that I'm looking for. Which way did he go? Which way did he go? Which way did he go? Oh, I see him. Okay, found him. Is this the locker? I see the locker. I'm not running this time. Boosh! Okay, so I know which way he's gonna go. Crawling is the new running. I like it. Good thing I chose to not hide in a locker, because that was actually my first choice. I need to get the fuck out of this room. Okay. So you... for sure went the way that I hope you went. Right? Good. Is this the right way? Oh fuck, this isn't even the right way! Oh my god. Where you at, friend? <gasps> Yay! You would think. Please give me the lights. Oh crap, I need to still turn that shit on. Batteries, thank you, cool, awesome. Got a locker. Kind of not digging the lockers anymore. You're not coming, right? Good man. Where are you? What is that? Not you. Are you coming this way? Hey, yep, you actually are. Yep. Can I zoom out now? Cool. Thank you. That's fun. Fuck you. Later. Uh, I choose this locker. Oh my god. Let's just take a moment to replace my batteries now while I can. Everyone hold your breath. Don't pick my locker. Don't pick my locker. Don't fucking pick my locker. Just walk away. Just walk away. That's what I thought, son. That's what I thought. It's like magic. Yep, you just keep on walking. Oh my god! <laughs> he has no idea. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh fuck my life! You motherfucker! Holy shit! No! 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 Open! Get in there! Are you kidding me? Oh my god! Put your running shoes on, kids! Oh, you gotta be shitting me! <laughs> oh my god! Why did he... So I'm not gonna follow that closely anymore. I'm just gonna let him do his thing. I think it's a straight shot, and I'm out of here. Oh. 
Juke shoes! Juke shoes! Later! Where are you going? Where are you going? Go, motherfucker, go, go, go. Turn the lights, please. Keep running, keep running, keep running, keep running, keep going, let's go. He is up my ass right now! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Nope, not cool. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. I need a bed. I need a bed. I need an adult. Give me an adult. You didn't see me. You didn't see me. You saw me, didn't you? You fucking saw me! Oh fuck my life! Nope, wrong way. Wrong way again. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Run through here, run through here. Faster, 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 faster. Fuck you, you can hang out in the basement. Enjoy the basement. Wow. Put on your juke shoes, kids. <laughs> Wow, man. Everyone take a moment to catch your breath. <laughs> Holy shit. Jesus, please us. Can I get a moment, please, game? Alright, so the power's back on. So now, do I want to go back here? I guess. How much money did I owe him? I don't know, dog. I didn't think I owed anybody money. He probably just wanted a Snickers. Right? This dude was like, alright, I'm going to St. Asylum. I better just take a moment, lace up my Jordans. So now can I turn it on? Okay. Who now? Really, dude? I'm sorry, my son. I didn't want to have to do this to you. But you can't leave. Not yet. There is so much yet for you to witness. Will you see it? Can you? Our Lord, the Wall Rider, tearing his truth into the unbelievers. Oh, damn. The only way out of this place is the truth. What? Except There's the some haunting shit. All doors will open before you. Oh, damn. That guy does need a toothbrush and a big deal. Like a... He's... An ass. I'm just not. <laughs> yeah, take their guns. Let's turn this game into fear. So I got a cozy room. <laughs> He's like, you can keep your camera. I think my favorite place to hide is under the bed. That's pretty much it. What notes do we got? Father Martin's cell. At least it's padded. I can sleep anywhere. Oh, really hungry? You missed some serious shit. Actually hungry? No. You're okay. You probably didn't want to see the last ten minutes. The priest, Father Martin, brought me here to show me something. Thinks I'm going to be a witness for whatever batshit crazy he's trying to sell me. This Dr. Wern Wernick. Wernick is at the center of whatever went wrong here, but he died more than ten years ago. Rest in peace, says the blood on the wall. Rest in peace and peace. R.I.P. in peace. Seriously, sadistic? Wow, dude. <laughs> oh, sorry, hungry. Shit. Let me out. Thank you. You're a good guy. Where'd you go?
Are you mad? You sound mad. Well, I'm in a fun place. Alright, cool. Doo -doo. Can I look at these guys' cells? This guy banging his head off the wall? Is that what I hear? What the hell? Oh, he's banging his head off the wall. Alright. That was a Shyamalan twist survivor. Oh! Shit on you. You wanna touch my beard? Hey, buddy. Give me a kiss. Asshole. Who's in here? Hmm. Yeah, I'm just gonna... I don't want you... Yeah, I'm not gonna let you just kind of run free like that. This game is really messed up, dude. Yeah, Rizzo gave away uh, two lol uh, skin keys from PAX. Maybe. He looks nervous. I would like to kill him. As would I. The preacher asked us not to. Put some fucking clothes on, guys. Not here. We give him a running start. There's an idea. And when we kill him, we kill him slow. Such patience. I want his tongue. And liver. They are yours. Alright, I'm tired of hearing you guys talk shit. I'll beat your ass later. You look like you've seen a ghost. You do. Come out here talking that jive. Do do do. Who's in here? Anyone? No one? Okay. <laughs> Fuck you! Where are your hands at, son? How you gonna hurt me with no hands? Well, I've already learned not to trust people in wheelchairs, so that's cool. Who's in here? No one. Oh, really, little Nick? You got the law key? Awesome, man. That is really cool. Congratulations, dude. Oh. Hey, buddy. Can I... I want to be the boogeyman. I'm going to hide under his bed and be the boogeyman. Anyone else want to jump at the window for me? Yeah, I don't trust you guys anymore. <laughs> I have everything against the handicap now. Someone sounds like he's having a good old time. Holy shit, man! I just fell right down. Are you eating that guy? I don't... I don't like what I just You're saw. Sick. Yep. All me, dude. All me. Wow. Oh, effectionable. I've been playing, um, about an hour. Actually, you can kind of see the top right there. 45 minutes. Yeah, no spoilers. Um, if you know the rules of the channel, I have it below the video. The info. Hey. Oh. Hey, you. No, I don't want to talk to you, dog. Talk to the hand, because the face ain't listening. Oh, am I up here now? Well, there's nothing up here, so fuck that. I've got you, dog! Oh, he's gone. Wah, wah. Game so simple, yet so freaking terrifying. No boilers! No boilers. There will be no hot water. Zero hot water. I didn't wait until I finished, oh, but I say so for you. Just wait. Oh. Nah, I'm cool. I don't, uh, I don't want any. It's okay, bud. 
God always follows a way. Follow the blood trails. What is this? Guessing a contamination chamber? Oh, that's horrible, informant. Hell yeah, I was looking for batteries. Good stuff. I'm like not really enjoying how uh, how low I'm getting on batteries. So I think there's a storyline behind this. Well, the game just kind of started. So, oh, what's up, fiddles? Welcome to the channel, man. You just missed a good time. Well, Swan, I learned to not trust the people in the wheelchairs because the last one I did scared the bejesus out of me. I think he wants me to go down the drain. Just guessing. What do we got? <clears throat> but Jessica, I have to. Silver Skills, hey, what's up, man? Thanks for coming out, hanging out on the channel. <laughs> Storyline so far, this guy's a reporter. There's messed up stuff going on at the asylum. Uh, he's supposed to investigate it. Anyways. Helen, Dr. Zeichner gave me your info to contact regarding the cancellation of the arts program. My patient, Martin Archambaud, has made enormous strides in his therapy on account of his finger painting. Yeah, finger painting. Just in the week since canceling the arts program, his schizo that's a schiz schizo effective associations of some higher calling have accelerated enormously. Please, just let the man finger paint, <laughs> right? Just let him finger paint. A few dollars you're saving on temper paint is more than swallowed by the cost of clozapine. Clozapine, whatever. I can't imagine the logic at play here unless Murkoff wants our patients to become more disengaged from reality. Please advise Dr. Neil Wolfram. I'm guessing that he does. Yeah, I live on myself, affectionable. Why? Why would you ask that? <laughs> Does bloody walls count as finger painting? Am I in your way, dog? Well, Jessica, I'm sorry. YOLO! See? Nothing to worry about. There is a cracked door, though. Closing doors behind you will slow your pursuers. <laughs> I like that they tell me that. As if to hint that I'm going to have a pursuer, like, right now. Oh, maybe not. Well, you look like a fun guy. They weren't experiments. They were rituals. A, a conjuring. Oh. Nah, I'm kidding, affection. Well, I thought you saw the, the lights turning on and off behind me. Um, that's, uh, that's my fiancé. I do live with her. So I'm just going to get in the habit of closing, like, everything. What is that? Something? Anything? No? Fair enough. Alright, so here's some lockers. I'm going to leave this door open, because I'm probably going to have to run to them. Like, really soon. When's the game going to get scary? You missed a lot. So, at the moment, I'm cool if it doesn't get scary for a little while. I need uh, I need a breather. Shut up! Let me think for a minute. Quiet. Uh, uh, quiet. Uh, uh. Oh. 
Hey, how are you doing? You're just waiting for me to walk by, huh? Watch this shit. Do do do. You don't see shit. Ha ha ha. Oh boy. <laughs> hey, what's up, Romino? Uh, well, okay. It's about to just be run and gun time. Oh, he just, he is waiting. He is waiting for it. And they're off! Oh, he's not even coming? Alright. I'll take it. Hi! Yikes! You don't want none of this, do we? I knew this was too good to be true. Help me, guy in the prison cell. Help me, Obi-Wan Kenobi! You're my only hope! Did you just open a door that I didn't think you could? Really now? Or is that just something that you're allowed to do because you're an asshole? Well, that's not fair. Fine. <laughs> right, Jessica? <laughs> well, I see two. So... I mean, if he's not in the first one I try, there's not a chance in hell he's in the second. Are you still here? Yeah, you're still here. Whee! Security is locked, of course. So, guy that was hanging out back here, what were you, what were you hiding? What, uh, what secrets you got back here? You hiding, uh, you hiding candy from me? Or you hiding a button? Okay. I like buttons. I'll take that. <laughs> if you try short of a happy meal. Hey, what's up, Lone Wolf? Rule number one with Mario. Oh my god. <laughs> Follow the blood. What blood? I don't see no blood. Fuck you. Oh shit, he's coming in. Oh no! Get the fuck, you shithead! We're gonna hide. We're gonna hide. Shut the door. Fuck you. That's why he slams doors. I learned something today. Um, uh, mm, um. He will not. There's no way. This desk can completely cover myself up. He punched me in the face! Oh, is he not coming? Really? That guy just wanted to come here and punch me in the face? That's it? My dude is shivering right now. I didn't even deserve it! Will you not be here? Please? Oh! Gee, why are you always here?! Fuck you, asshole! Enjoy the room! It's free! 
Free of charge. Let me in, let me in, let me in, let me in, let me in. Let me in faster! Thank you. <laughs> I'm giving out... <laughs> I'm giving out rooms like the hotel suites, baby. Will you guys stop being naked? They're like Brock Samson. <laughs> He's always on the other side of the door. I'm so tired of these guys. Seriously, shut up. You're not Brock Samson. You'll never be Brock Samson. You can't kill people naked. You want some of this shit, son? You want none of this. I will body you. Can I, like, shimmy? Oh, I can. Oh wait, what's over here? Nothing. Can I look down? No. The Dick Twins. <laughs> yes, yeah, still no twerking. They're gonna come at me. Oh, maybe not. I'm just waiting for it. I'm I'm ready. All right. Oh, they're not even gonna. I guess. Well, now I'm here with them. That's not good at all. Fuck the blood. I got stuff I want to do. More batteries, please. There we go. <laughs> They're kind of like the Lutes twins. Except not as smart. And they kill you. And they can't time travel. And they're naked. They're like, they're nothing like the Lutes twins. <laughs> Confidential. Just punch roll. Just punch holes through the roof. <laughs> oh my God, Camarado. The Twix. Oh man. Proper purge gate maintenance is crucial to Project Wall Rider security. Please refer to Mon Murkoff Corp. Maintenance manual, blah, 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 or seek guidance from a supervisor with the proper security clearance. Okay. Whatever you say there, chief. Well, that's broken. Of course the naked guys are in the shower. Like, really? It's everyone's worst nightmare. Why do I need a keycard? Isn't there like a dead guy like right here? Give me your key card. Nope, you have nothing. Am I partnered? No, I am not partnered. Takes a heck of a lot more than than uh, what I've got going on to be partnered. Oh shit, who are you? Are you Walker? Hi, Walker. That was a note. Wow. <laughs> Don't drop the soap! Oh, what's up? Hey, what's up, Rex? My dick's so sharp, I use it as a shiv. Yeah, everyone new to the stream, um, I'm looking down a lot because that's actually where my chat is. I don't have a dual monitor set up. I want to get one. I would love to have one. Um, but I use the phone for now with the, the chat function. So if I'm missing anything, I'm sorry. And if you see me looking down a lot, it's because I'm trying to keep up with you guys. Fuck this place. Seriously? Just fuck this place. I am right there with you, dude. Dying keeps moving lower on the list of the worst things that could happen to me here. Have I pissed myself yet? Come on now. Piss myself. I got nothing. Nor, it's actually 500 daily. Well, average. 
500. I cannot shake Chris Walker. <laughs> the big ugly fucker who likes ripping off people's heads. He can rip off a head? I guess he can. I just saw him do it. I hear him muttering about security protocols, containment. What if he's not the problem? What if he's trying to fix it? <laughs> if he's trying to fucking fix it, then damn. That's bananas. Yeah, that's right, Baron. About four or five hundred. Hey, Michaela Monster. Hi. Welcome to the channel. Thanks for stopping in. Oh. Well, how about that? You learn something new every day. Look at this dude just running. Is there anyone following me? Good. Relinquish your key card to me. There's something I must do. Oh boy, there's a lot of noise and a lot of stuff. And cue the bad stuff right now. Wait. Okay. Not yet. Oh boy. It's shower time! Actually, we replaced my battery first. Quick! To the showers! Hua! It's dark! Wow! I did not expect that. Okay, good. Nothing tried to kill me. Where are you guys going? Exit through the showers. Okay. Oh, is that big man again? Just leave him alone! Leave Brittany alone! Just run to you. Oh, fuck my life! Can I jump out the window? Because I'm going. Do they know I'm out here? Oh god, I hope they don't know I'm out here. Oh, are you serious, dude? Oh, it's them? Oh, ho, ho. Dude, I keep seeing that curtain and it's like freaking me out. Oh. Yeah, I guess that is their voices. Oh. Can I peek up? Can I just give a little peek? Oh, can I run now? Am I allowed to run? Because I don't want to fight them at all. Did I go the right way? Oh my god, please tell me I went the right way. Oh, thank god. Shut the door. Shut the door. Shut the door. Shut the door. Thank you. This is right, right? Yeah. <laughs> We're feeling the jump scares. It's happening. Oh. <laughs> I gotcha, Baron. I gotcha. So why not go to the dark? Because... That's always a smart choice. Gonna leave that open. Meh. Yeah. I don't... Yeah, we're just gonna shut that. I got, a, I got a good feeling about this room. Never go back. <laughs> oh, Ken, you're out? Okay, man, good night. Thanks for hanging out with us, man. Hope we didn't give you nightmares. Dr. Wernick. Wernick. Death certificate. This game's giving me indigestion. State of Colorado. Hold to light to view watermark. Town or city. Yeah, 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 yeah. Rudolph, Gustav, Mernick. Length of residence in a city or town where death occurred. Seven months. How long in the U.S. of foreign something something. Blah, blah, blah. Blah. Blah, blah. He was old as hell. Anyways, I hereby certify that I attended deceased from June 4th, 2003 to February 28th, 2009. 
that I saw him alive on February 27th, 2009, that death occurred on the date stated above at 4.11 a.m. The principal cause of death and related causes of importance were as follows. Heart failure due to advanced age. This is to certify that this is a true and correct copy of the official record. Something tells me it's not the official record. Oh, we should be saying it Vernke? Okay. Or Vernick? <laughs> Never trust anything. Hey, yeah, you guys never freaking go to bed anyways, so... You're not missing out. You're not missing out on sleep, my god. You guys stay up with me, like, every freaking night. Oh, so is this... So, when you shock them to death and they poop their pants, they have a spot... Well, how about that? I learned something today. Hmm. Learn something new every day. The electro shitter. <laughs> Baron, why do you have two day old pizza? Just eat it, man. Oh god, I really hate when I open a door into the dark, because that is that's what's gonna get me. That is what's gonna just completely just ruin my ass. I like how I'm going to security because that's like the one place I don't want to go. And okay. Oh, great. Hold your breath. Uh, uh, okay. I think I need to stop doing that. The whole opening doors slowly, because all it's going to do is just completely scare the shit out of me when something's actually there. Yo, yeah right? We're just going to play this, we're going to run this through like it's like I'm playing Unfair Mario. We're going to YOLO everything, YOLO jump, YOLO open doors, just let her rip. <laughs> You'll open. Nope. Oh, are you really? Oh, you're really coming through, aren't you? Wow. Okay. Yep. Event. Great. Perfect. Can I get up there like right now? Thank you. Thank you. Bye bye. I don't want to play with you today, sir. Oh, I swear to God, if you can fit in this event, I am gonna shit my pants. Oh, who came in? Someone come in? Whoa! Whoa! Wait! Oh, shit! No! Wrong way! No! Oh, you can just open it, can't you? Wow! And that's on fire. Okay, fuck my life. And I'm out the window. Am I alive? I'm alive. Oh shit, I'm in the shit now. Wow. <sighs> oh, you serious? Get the camera, dude. Oh my god, is this where I just was? And this is what he did? Dude, at least I got beds here. Are you fucking kidding me? Are you really coming? Oh, that is you. Holy no, no. Nope. No. Swear to God, if you know I'm under here and I have no battery, I'm gonna freak the hell out. Okay, good stuff. Close every door, he says. <laughs> Alright, I'm just gonna let these batteries just kinda go. Okay. At least it's like pitch black down here. But, at the same time, I can't see this guy for shit. Where is he upstairs? 
Where is he? <gasps> He's under the stairs. No, you do not see me, sir. Nope, no. Oh, god damn it. God damn, god damn. Nope, no, no. Bed, 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 bed. If being a kid taught me anything, it was hiding under the bed was the safest goddamn spot you could ever find. <laughs> Thank God for being a kid. <laughs> Crack baby. <laughs> yep, just walk away, and I'm just going to do me. You do you, and I'll do me. Yep, you don't hear shit. You don't know that I'm here. You can't smell me. I'm just going to walk away. We are just going to go our separate paths. And we're going to pretend this never happened. Am I going around in a circle and ultimately getting... Oh! Oh! No! No! No, 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 no! No, no! No, no, no! And to the bed! Oh my god, dude, are you kidding me? You're, yeah, right, Vermino? The bed doesn't always save you. But I don't have Liam Neeson. That's the that's the one thing, is that... That girl had Liam Neeson. I don't have Liam Neeson. Okay. So he went this way. Why does he sound like he's beside me, then? Oh, shit, he's... I am so glad I didn't do that. Dude, how the hell am I going to get past this guy? I need to find a, a room. Hi. How you doing? Yep. Yep. You just, you keep going that way. Everyone needs a Liam Neeson. What's up, Paladin Feed? Haven't seen you in a while, man. Can I just... Let me pass? Just... Oh, okay, he's just jumping that. Okay, I understand. I see where you're going. If I can just get into that room. Where'd he go? Where did he go? Did he really just turn where I have to... Oh, you gotta be kidding me, dude! Oh, you mother... Oh, man! You're coming back out, huh? Wait, wait. Holy shit, no, I have a great idea. I know what he did. He broke down the door. Circling. Yep, you just do your thing, baby. Because I've got ideas. And while you're looking that way, later. That's locked. That sucks. Mm-mm, yep, that's not, that's by him. Holy f- Really, guy? Come on, I got more shit to worry about than you. Damn you. <sighs> Give me a second, I gotta take a drink of freaking- soda. He just scares me! I'm getting mad. I'm getting mad at being jump scared. I'm like, just leave me alone, dog. Okay, so we're gonna shut this, because I learned something. That he can just open those. What am I, in the Thunderdome? Oh, no, you're cool, right? Are you cool? You look like Voldo from Soul Calibur. Are you really, like, you want to mess with me right now? Okay. Damn, dude. What are you... Well, dude, I don't like this guy. He's, like, really rubbing me the wrong way. Okay, what's up? Tell me a secret. Don't be scared, really. Great fucking secret, dude.
Is this guy gonna do something fucked up? Okay, you already told me your secret. I'm done with you, dog. I'm over you. What's in here? More places to hide. I, I understand you want to help me, but you're being a, a kind of a dick about it. He has some stuff to get done. <laughs> Eddie needs a feel-good gif. Somebody give Eddie a feel-good gif, please. Let's just replace his battery. That's cool. He's my pet. Well, I don't think he's gonna last too long. Cause I'm climbing this shit. You and me both, Mister. Wait, can I wait? Hold what to open? I can open this. There's nobody in there. Are you still here? No. Get the fuck out of here, dog. <laughs> yeah, everyone's uh everyone's a little on edge. Will you stop doing that? Enjoy the fall, dickhead. Why do people in chairs? So tired of people in chairs, man. I can't trust them anymore. Are you gonna do something? Dude, be a bro. Will you please be a bro? Oh, okay, cool. This guy sounds like uh, Jim Carrey. Listen there. I just like to be prepared. He did not kill his enemies. Fair enough. Oh, hi. See, that's the power of the bed. I had no idea he was even there. Like, that's great. That's the power of the bed. Right? He sounded like he, he really did sound like Jim Carrey. It's still happening! Listen, dog. If I wanted your advice, I'd ask for it. Just saying. Rudolph G. Vernick. Dr. Rudolph G. Vernick, age 90, passed away doing the work he loved on February 28, 2009. He was born in 1918 in Munich, Germany, and achieved fame in the mathematic and scientific communities for a paper written with early computing pioneer... Alan Turing. After a cloudy history with the German war effort, he emigrated to the United States in 1949 with a visa from the state government. Several decades of government research in Los Alamos led to New Mexico, where Dr. Vernick retired to pursue landscape photography and care for his cats. Aww. He came to Colorado shortly after the turn of the millennium to pursue charitable work for the Murnkoff Corporation. A statement from the co uh, company calls Dr. Vernick a true humanitarian with a generous spirit. He, le 